Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight, and I just realized that I have been running at least one version of the uh, the Freelance Universe mod behind. And look at this. They've changed the entire way that it opens. You can just go right to load FLU. Just goes right in. And you still have to select it. Okay, well, that's different. Now, in the last video, I did mention the proper precautions. Mining vessel, which is, you know it's a mining vessel because of the U. And I named this after one of the messages that would come up from the administrators on that was built into the, the game. I don't even know if it's still there. That basically would warn you that this is a, a, a PvP server, so make sure you take proper precautions. And this is why I picked that name. Here it is. Proper precautions. And how is this proper precautions if it's a PvP server? It is just dev, especially if you're coming up from, from behind. Oh yeah. Does it have some, yeah, it still has a pretty good volley from the front. We're, we're, we're gunning stuff. Where, where are we? Here we are, we're in Omicron Theta. It's right outside Planet Pygar. I'm trying to think what the best thing to do here would be. I'm almost positive it's docked somewhere here. 60% off is in New York. That's an interesting thing. Let us, let us fly this thing around. And I think maybe Omicron, you know, Omega, Omega 41, not Omicron. Might be the best way to do this. First of all, it'll demonstrate exactly what a nightmare this thing is in the rocks. Now this one, of course, has a new, mostly neutral. Mostly, it's it's people they, the nomads don't like it. We have a we have a we could go to right to gamma and, and prove that out. But we can get to Gamma through 41, as I recall. Let's see, let's look at the, let's look at the universe map here. That's Patrol Venice. Where do we get to that? Yeah, there we go. Uh, 41 faded. No, we, I don't know if this has ever been to Gamma. There's a lot of exploring for this ship. Of course, the reason is that it's a little bit bouncy through the rocks, as you can see. Ning, ning, ning. Dog. But he, 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 he. It's such a big uh, ship that I think it, it tricks out the camera a little bit here, or a lot. There are bigger, there are bigger, but not if you're uh, not if you're not part of an active clan on the server. Ah, yes, I do have the high definition mod installed. Let's head to Freeport 5. Well, we can't dock. So there's not really a whole lot of point to that. Let's see, is there is there a jump point here? Let's now, in this system, there's a lot of radiation. Like, I can burn this ship down out here. That's that's a neutron star. Not quite a black hole, but it's pretty darn nasty. But at least we know we're doing the good part of the... Uh, yeah, let's go back. I want something to shoot at. Let's go into Gamma. 
the one thing I can do without uh, without jazzing up my um, my rep is go hunt nomads. So this could take a little while. But because it's time to talk. Let's look around a bit. Can we shoot now? No, we're in, we're in cruise mode here. Can't shoot while on autopilot. I may have to take manual control, stop it, and then guide it in. Let's 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 do that. I'm I'm using I'm turning and I'm using reverse thrust here just to line it right up. Now, cruise engines charging. Then, if we could avoid the rocks, F3. Let's go to Gamma. So I do have, I'm, I do know it's working. I did look it up. I know I was uh, fooling with the freelancer mod manager. I do have the high definition textures installed. That mod, which I highly recommend. I believe these are all available still off the 24-7 Freelancer Universe forum page for downloads. Let's lock that a little bit so you can't see the bouncing quite as much. Locks the, uh, the ship in center of view here and everything else is, you can tell it's still zipping around, but at least it shouldn't make it too nauseous. And before we were official, this was like, well, hey, I forget exactly how many millions this was. It's like 250 million, 150 million. It's something, 75 million maybe? No, 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 wait, I'm right. 75 million is the LT. This was 50 million. I think we owed all of that to, to Mr. Bonkers. Mr. Bonkers used to grind and he funded this whole clan. He's, you know, the founder of the feast for the base clan in this server. And yes, I am still friends with him. We talk periodically on Steam. And just an awesome guy. I can't believe, you know, Danger. I've met him like damage. 15 Detected. years ago. We've been friends a long time. Uh, we're stuck. Keep wiggling. I think that's why they built the wiggle in here, is that it's, uh, so it won't get stuck and just stay there. Because other, other ships, you hit that bing, and it sends you off in a strange direction. This thing is so massive. Dock. Okay, let's see if we can dock without getting to, uh, going to a manual drive mode here. Booga, 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 booga. In Omicron Gamma, we can usefully mine stuff go out here we can actually mine artifacts and stuff like that while we're shooting at things. Yeah, it would take time. I'm trying to remember what um oh hey we got in it has started the docking animation. Alright, that could be a problem. Oh, come on. Just scraping along the bottom of this. Oh. Wiggle. I think we're clear of it. Ah, wiggle, wiggle. There we go. I wonder what changes they've made to the to the nomads in this system. All right, we want to go out this way through the rocks. Apparently, tell you want to go find bases and stuff like that, but uh, because this is a capital ship, you can't land anywhere. It, it has to be assigned to a specific base 
that it will return to when it gets blown up. And as a matter of fact, and you've, if you've seen other videos where I'm using the large transport CLTs, what you do is you load it up with stuff, you fly it to its destination, dump all the stuff into space, switch to a different character on the same account that has, you know, an AT, an armor transport, or something like that. Oh dear, this is going to be... Bleh. There we go. This could take a while. And then you beam the stuff back in, and then go back and forth, beaming it in, landing on the planet, selling it as quickly as possible before it derezzes in space. You can do it in an empty, you know, without anybody in the system if you're quick. You gotta be quick. If you stay too long on the planet, it'll disappear. But there's a lot of danger to using one of these larger systems, you know, one of the larger ships in these systems. But if you have a friend, if you've got a fellow, you know, someone, you know, working with you, who can stay outside, they can make sure that the stuff doesn't uh, despawn. How much space does this have? Was it a thousand? Does it say how much? Cargo holds 800. I feel like that might have changed at some point. Max uh, bats and nanobots, uh, 313. We don't have any. We have to get... <laughs> there was a big debate on this server about bats and nanobots and using them in PvP. People, it was this whole thing where if you were regenning during, you know, player versus player combat, that was like almost, you know, verboten as far as the culture. I, you know, oh, you're just dragging things out. I'm buying myself time so I can shoot you. You know, that was just a whole... Do we have anything that's coming after us? Band is taking damage. What, what, what kind of ships are out there? Nothing so far. <coughs> Corsairs, bounty hunters, we're okay with them. Oh dear. Let's let's call up the map and call up the base. We should have some patrol paths. Here we go. That's where we want to go. Go to. These all rotate us out of this wedged in position. Booga, 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 booga. Now, if you jump into the Nomad system, what the heck does it do? It should be an unknown jump hole. <coughs> if you jump, I've been working in the attic and now I'm getting that cough back. Work. Obviously, I have some severe allergy to dust. Or whatever the heck's up there. Okay, we're closing in on this. Come on, light it up. Get it in scanner range. Um, hello? Come on, I don't know where in the system. Where the heck is the, uh... There should be a jump hole around here. That should come up by now. Nothing? Nothing? Was it not that far out? I mean, it's... Let's zoom out. It's a faded jump hole. Am I right? I know it was up in here. Of course, they changed the mod, so maybe there's something different. Going on. Let's try, let's try the other obvious waypoint. Huh? We're certainly wiggling around enough in here. I've got my scanner set set to show everything. Let's see, gun weapons. Minor turrets. I guess we can look at that while we're reviewing the. Uh... Because it doesn't let you select any. There's nothing droppable there. Let's... 
Because because the guns are hard fixed, you can't look at them. The only thing we have that's added on is the advanced countermeasure wrapper. Maybe we should do the time warp again. Let's do the time. I, where am I going? I'm not going in the right direction. <coughs> I didn't select the, the waypoint properly, so now we're going off into deep space. Back here, you can you can now you can go off into space like this forever and never really get anywhere. All right, well then, we need to, but at least there's no rocks, so it'll be easy to turn it around. So we'll turn it around. We'll hit the go to here. See how hard it's swinging. Just swing it. Come on, just just swing it. Taking them proper precautions. Rocking them proper precautions. Why is it doing that now? It's not even... That might have been a thing. That might have been a thing that was in GoTo, even back in the day when I would remember what was going on. Now, in the original game, the Nomads Danger. did not have radiation damage detected. Did not have cruise disruptors. They have since captured enough humans that now they do. So they can a cruise disruptor. If you if, if you're in cruise mode here with your full engines up at 300, will hit you and then drop you into regular speeds. Alright. This could take a little while. So let's, uh, especially if we get caught on rocks. So let's just do the time warp again here. Alright, now this is... They must have changed something. I know. There were jump holes up here. I mean, I've been playing the game since 2005. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cruise this out to here, out into deep space. And then, <clears throat> then what we're going to do is we're going to switch over to a smaller, more nimble craft. We're going to do a little bit of exploring. We're going to explore again. Though. Because in this in this game, I do I did take proper precautions. I do have other ships. They're not shooting at me, they're shooting around me. I am getting hit. Is there anything any loot? I'm taking on a course. We're in turret view, but we're still in cruise mode. We're just stuck. I've got it. Laying into him. Twinkle. What are we caught? Retreat, I'm badly damaged. I don't even see us caught on anything. Using the, the strafe button here. We're just turning it. Let's see. What's going on? Strafe was Q, right? Okay, we got the go to going again. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. All right. Wait, all right, all right, all right. Let's let's do the time warp again. I could have swore I've updated this since May of 2016, but I mean, you know. Maybe I updated it like April of 2016 and then thought I had the latest one and it was just not because I had like 185 point, 1857 so it was like you know really close to 1.86. Which that leads us open to a whole lot of different possibilities. Preparing to take on bounty hunters. 
you find who got me hanging, 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 hanging. Now, interesting note, you can get it to fly smoothly if you just take it, if you leave it in cruise, in free flight. Once you get going in the right direction, it will be fine. As far as that's concerned. It's when you get oh, go-to. This isn't a normal thing for normal ships. It has to do with something to do with the way the cab ships are. Well, we're going to put this in orbit around planet Crete. One of the most important planets in the game. This thing does not go very fast. It has no thruster. So you're pretty much limited to your we're, we're, we're at dead stop at this point. But let us switch out. Select new character. I have a Defender Elite. It's all the way in Cambridge. Well, we need this Defender Elite, although I know why it's in Cambridge. That was where we would unload stuff in Cambridge. If I can show you where the, the AT is. <coughs> We're here at what base? Cambridge Research Station. Now this was this was you know commodities buying Nomad Power Cell. Ah, I see this was the deal. Nomad Laser a million? A million dollars per Nomad Laser? I have a lot of nomad lasers. This is this is interesting. But this is Alien Orgs run was a two thousand. That's why you'd always do the Alien Orgs here. Nomad power cells are eight million. I have eight nomad lasers. I'm almost positive I have a bunch of nomad lasers. Maybe they've made the nomads a lot more difficult to kill. I don't know. Um let's see. My Defender Elite. Defender Elite's a unique ship to the game. Do we have anything loaded on here, or is it just a fighter? Okay, we've got two Del Cids. Blasters. I have blasters in cans. So maybe the laser's a new thing that drops, and you have to have the mommy. I have no Nomad lasers. I don't even know. We got Death, a Death's Hand turret. Death, Death's, Death's Hand turret. And got another class nine. It's an interesting setup. Certainly it will do more than well. It's got good armor. It's got a little bit less as far as class ten weapons, but the class nine I have mounted will more than make up for that. I have, I have the, uh, I have the option set for Del, to zone a Del Cid set to visible. Apparently, originally when the game was released, there was some glitch where they, they didn't have uh, a graphic associated with them, or it wasn't enabled properly, and the mod fixed that. That used to be a, a trick back on the old, uh, when we used to run Vanilla, back on the, the, the Get On It server, is you have ships set up with just four Tizona Del Cid's and missiles. So you'd swoop in on somebody, blast them, they wouldn't even see where it was coming from. You know, especially in a system battle, just bap, 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 because the, the, the bullets were invisible. And then you could, you drop their, one hit drops their shields completely from four Tizona Del Cid's. Bam, bam, missiles. Oof. And then that was it. You could kill someone really quickly. That was an expensive setup, but I mean, when you're doing system battles, you know, costs are no object. Cost is not an object when you're trying to take a system. You wouldn't want to constantly do this against, you know, AI because you'd just go broke. But when you only have to, ha when you only have eight people to deal with. Yeah, the number of missiles you're carrying is enough. 
It's been so long, I don't even remember. How many missiles? I think it's 50. Yeah, 50 is the standard max. Uh, everything turned on? Yeah. Does this only have two? Nine, nine, ten, ten, ten. Interesting. I've, I've got a death's hand. I, I'm missing a nomad class gun on this. I've got a death's hand here instead. For whatever reason. And you can look at it. It does, you know, it's 264 at a high refresh rate. But I mean, the, the blaster. I definitely want we want to get like a no another nomad gun on this I would think. Stop. It'll do well enough for what we're doing, which is potentially hunting nomads. Potentially. If we can find out where they've gone. All right, let's jump into Omega Five. From Omega Five to Omega Forty One. Omega Forty One should there should be a jump hole. To Gamma from Mega from Mega Forty One, as I recall. I don't think it was on the uh, on the map for proper precautions because it's off in the rocks and you don't drive proper precautions generally. I'm trying to. I'm making a video. You know, it's, it was really much more a symbolic thing, and we, we did use it for some runs before. Has she ever been here? We can zip over right over the past Cadiz and head right to Omega 41. Go to. Frame rate's starting to drop off again, which I don't understand because right now I've got like 1.3 terabytes free on the main drive. That really is perplexing. I realize there's a lot of rocks going on here, but we're talking a game from 2003. I can, I know I can run this mode. Not too much activity going on because it's an early Monday morning. It is Columbus Day, but it's early. So people sleep in. And let's hit dock and see if this improves. Now it's suddenly up to 140. I mean, it's just the weirdest thing. Yeah, this is happening to me in TF2. It's happening to me periodically in GTA. I don't know. Maybe my graphics card's trying to pack it in, as they would proverbially say. <coughs> this only has a cutter mine on it, too. It doesn't have a ripper. There we go. Omicron Gamma. This has it on on the map. Go to. Now this ship, I have to watch myself because it's a regular ship. It's not a capital ship, and the gamma around here, the the the, the neutron radiation coming off of that, the, the the hard radiation will just start to eat the ship, especially especially if you get too close to that. And by the way, you, this slowdown in frame rate is not typical to the game. Like I said, I'm having some kind of issue with my computer. It's just beautiful. You got, you gotta love it. People knew the game. You might notice that the planets themselves have docking rings. That was kind of a a thing that they, they it was a, a game mechanic. Everything had to have a point where you would to land. You had to have something you could click on. I forget exactly how they physically described it in game. Again, the Defender Elite not so much a vanilla available craft. I think it was in game. You could see some of these. But wasn't a player ownable or something like that? They took what they took a defender and they they boofed it, you know, boofed it, 
boosted it up, beefed it up. If you take boosted and beefed, you get boofed. By the way, that's that's a thing. If you boofed it up, that means you 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 beefed it up and you boosted it. Stop. I might start using that now. Yeah, we boofed it right up. You need a good boofing. And that smooths right out again. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with this. Yeah. Okay. So, in theory, uh, we don't have a whole lot available. Here. We're gonna have to do a little bit of actual exploration here. Here I want I wanna find a base to land to, otherwise I'm gonna be all the way back in Cambridge should something go awry. I'm gonna do the time warp again, see if that will clear up the uh, the frame rate jumping. Yeah, when I, when I stopped recording it went to 160. They've done... I start recording again, down, down to 8, and now it's back up to 27. They've done something, I think, to Windows that is just making my, my recording software just incompatible with the way the operating system is working. Either that, or maybe I forget whether I have Backblaze still running. Maybe it's Backblaze is kicking in periodically. I'm just stealing all of my hard drive resources or something. I, I don't know. Now it's 90. Now, there's just as much debris, and yet I've got... 90. Let's, yeah, let's dock at Tripoli. Object. Tripoli, I believe, is one of the places you can get, but his own adults. I don't remember if you have to be friendly or just neutral to get the Tiz. Check. The only quest to dock is granted. Please proceed to <laughs> dock two. Thank you. I'm a trainer from This is Corsair's Sigma Zero. Triple E ship. Get me inside and get me out of the leg. Why am I having this? Oh my goodness. It's an interesting thing. If you look at pretty much every video I'm making in early October, there's gonna be some mention of I really need to take a break from recording and and figure out why I'm having these problems. The good news for as far as Spaced Out Saturdays are concerned is I have a whole bunch of off-world trading videos. So I might I might rotate in the off-world off -world trading videos. We will do that. I haven't uploaded any of them, anything yet. I haven't uploaded the freelancer videos or as of this point. So maybe, maybe, just maybe we want to load in be able to do the, all the freelancer videos, and then, you know, that I have. It's like four, something like that, four or five. I'll do all the um, the freelancer videos, then switch it over to off-world trading, which is kind of which is another space game. We'll, we'll throw a couple things, and we'll mix it up with some other things in there that I already have. While well, I try to figure out why my system keeps barfing itself, so I have to take it apart and blow the dust out of it again. I don't know what's going on. If we look at like, I sh should not be getting frame drops here. Yeah. That's just not... Repair. Repair everything. All that damage came from the radiation. And if we can look at what kind of uh, stuffs we can buy here. Now, Baraco, that's a good, you know, anti-shield uh, gun for you know, smaller ships. The Baraco turret, that's critical for if you're if you're running, you know, one of the standard freighters. If you're not running, you know, an armored transport or something like that, let's say you're using a dromedary. One of the, the big dromedary builds would be three Baracos or three advanced debilitators because they have the same stats, as I recall. And then a bunch of uh, catapult missiles or something like that along those lines because then you can just, you know, blast someone's shields down. You, I have taken out very heavy fighters that way. Not many. It was like one or two and it was like, oh my god, this is the greatest moment of my life. But, you know, it's, it's doable. 
I don't see the Tiz, so they can't. The Tiz must be at, uh, at the main planet. All right, it's been a while. Can we look at the bar? We always look at the bar. Eighteen loading a bar, and that's just ridiculous. It'd be really interesting if my voice is getting modulated into some kind of strange mode here we got by the complete lack of frame rates. It's one of those best laid plans of mice and men kind of things, you know? Of course, you know, I've always, always had problems with recording freelancer. Back in the day when I had, you know, a slower all computer, the we all you. did. This is the back in the day. <laughs> if I tried to record, I could record, but if I was using TeamSpeak and I hit the button to talk, it would just send out massive amounts of static and you couldn't, I couldn't talk and record. So, I ended up going for the experience as opposed to taking the picture and I, I don't regret that. That, that was, those are such good times, such good memories. If I can ever get it all straightened out, I maybe mean, we can resurrect some of that. I don't know. I don't know. I might have to. Maybe. Maybe you know, people. We have to move on to a different game. I don't know. We'll have to see. Can we get enough people playing again? Come on, guys. This is the game. This is the game we want to do this in. Go freelancer. Go freelancer. See. Of course, there's always had trouble with, you know, food. That was always a thing. With new advances in ship technology. Alright, that's all good. Back up to 120, let's launch to space and hope for the best. Now we're going to probably want to go to Crete and land there. Go to. Let me, let's do the time warp momentarily. Let's lock up the unknown planet here and go that way. Okay. This killed all of my back blaze. Backups, and that seems like it smoothed things some things out. Hey, that's just it. Hey, it's, it's a backblaze thing. That that looks pretty definitive. All right, so maybe we'll go back to uh, back to the point for alternating off-road trading and, and freelancer videos. If I can keep maintaining a stream of freelancer videos, doesn't mean you won't get a couple off-world trading in a row from time to time. But that's going to be a thing. It's been so long since I've been here. Oh, these crazy cannibals. Oh, only the one time. You eat one foot, you know? It's, they did have some incident where they were doing a lot of starvation. Important uh, location here for is starting the game up. This is one of the places you can get the Titan. And the Titan has the best stats in the game except for one. The stat that it's not good on is maneuverability, and that's kind of a thing where it's kind of important. So, but there were a, a few players that I can remember who used to make the Titan really work. Epion was one. He used to fly the fridge. Is it Atlas? I want to say it's Atlas. See, these are the two best missiles. Get the Salamanca here. Where did you get the tits? This is on the seat. Huh. I don't even know. I used to know. Were they available at Freeport 9? 
something like that. Was there something on that note? What are the other systems here? I'm gonna have to figure that out. Yeah, this is much better. Maybe it's just maybe it's been backblades and messing with me this whole time. Still highly recommend it, you know. For All the right, price. Stop. Thank you for your help. Able to have all of your stuff now. You can now move at a much faster clip. Actually, let's, let's do it this way. Let's hit all the points. All the patrol points. All at once. It won't take long on this ship. We're doing, we're doing a lot more speed, a lot less bippity boppity. You'll notice it doesn't normally go bippity 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 bippity. That's only a cap ship kind of thing. And again, I think it's built in so that they don't get stuck on stuff. Because if you were in cruise and you hit one of those asteroids and you don't bounce off, well, there's your day. Yeah, here, let's hit the end. Calmera, you can't land on. It's just there, as I recall. Unless they've changed that. Danger. Radiation now let's damage. change over, because we should be able to pick up in scanner range here. Pretty much everything. Select the waypoint. Kick it. As far as, let's see, 60% off is still a year. Nothing on the near own red. Player status, there we go. <coughs> Somehow we're a little bit unhappy with Corsairs. I wonder why. I must have killed something by accident. I don't, I don't know. Something happened. I mean, it's fine. It's not going to affect anything. But And of course, this was a shared account. I wonder if somebody else did something. Back in the day, 10 years ago, or whatever. I think it was a team over here. Has it really been that long? That would have been 2009. That might have actually even been after we were heavily done playing with this. It's amazing how long this game has been you know, look at 16 years, this server. Well, I've been playing the game long enough to know that I should be seeing some, some holes here. <laughs> the title of this video, Can't Find the Hole. That'll be just, you know. Oh, come now. This isn't like a modded in one, there's one that's really here. Alright, I'm gonna do the time warp again and try and see if I can figure this out. Man, this almost has the feel of a Mandela effect for me, because I mean, you gotta realize something. Back in 2004, when, um, when I started playing, and I was recruited by Whiskey Sour, to be in base. Or just whiskey for short as he mostly went. Um, what I did, I said, look, I can't really be that involved in the, you know, I can't be involved in the regular day-to-day -day operations. I'm too busy. <laughs> uh, let's see how, we see how that worked out. And all I did was I used to, I used to obtain uh, nomad weapons for them. I'd go out to, like, this point over here, jump into the, the jump hole, and then I would... Blast the crap out of the nomads, the old school vanilla nomads, and that was that. I mean, that was just what I did. There should be somewhere up here a uh, a jump hole to Alpha, isn't there? Well, you have to go. That might be that might be in theta. You have to go from the theta to Alpha. There should, I should have seen the, the theta jump hole here too somewhere. It must be, let's head let's head right here. I think it's like down this way. 
close enough. Go to. So I can go to. So I know this system. I mean, they must have. They, you know, I know they added a bunch of systems. They must have moved one or deleted one or done something here. Or I did something. To, maybe I screwed something up when I added my uh, my updated the mod. I don't know that I could. That could. There's a possibility because there's not that much to it. I, I didn't wipe everything and start fresh. But if I'm just uninstalling it to vanilla and install and reinstalling it back with the J flip and the the high def still, and I don't I don't see why that would be a problem. There's the the Omicron Theta jump hole. Let's let's dock that just to get everything. Dog. On the map for this little chip. The only reason I have uh, proper precautions as the ship here at all was so that I could have a, a fighter in case, you know, the main miner or whatever got attacked at its destination, which often happens. You can switch out, switch to, to protect the. Uh, F1 and protect the cargo, switch to a fighter, blow the guy up, make him leave. Or fight with him and get blown up repeatedly long enough until they got bored and then left. And then eventually, or just, just go have dinner. Log out all together and have dinner, come back and eventually sell the stuff. But alright, so now we're... See if we got a wreck, a wreck there, we could get weapons off of the rebel. We're gonna let that be for right now. In theory, there used to be a trick where if you could get the AI to shoot the thing and you could beam the weapons in it, it wouldn't count against you having have seen it and then you can mine them all together, but it's really tricky to do. You have to be very really lucky. So I don't know what to tell you folks. I don't know why I cannot see a um a jump hole to the unknown here. So you get on the get on the forums and see if I can figure something out. On that kind of disappointing note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your extremely confused Black Knight. <laughs> I guess have a great night? I don't know. This kind of fell apart. You ever have a video just fall apart on you? You gotta do this whole thing and then it's just like, what happened here? I just don't. No! Have a great night. If it's not one thing, it's another. Well, gotta run.